Welcome to the My Toy Smart Story Hour. Today we will be reading The Nose That Didn't Fit by Andy Green. The Nose That Didn't Fit, a Rory Roo tale by Andy Green. Roo was a monster who wanted to hide the fact that his nose was a very large size. He thought that his snout just didn't fit and he wished every day it would shrink quite a bit. When he saw his reflection, he'd frown at the sight. How to look better, he read through the night. From nose caps to new tricks, Rue tried to pretend that his nose was the same as that of his friends. Yet with all his great efforts, the problem remained. He had a big nose, and he wanted it changed. Oh, what should I do, Rue said to himself. I must find the wizard and ask for his help. So he searched and he searched, feeling hopeless until he found the great wizard on top of a hill. Oh, magic one, Rue began to implore. The way that I look, I can't stand any more. Others have noses that fit them so snugly. But I have this honker that makes me feel ugly. Oh, it isn't your nose, the wizard said with a grumble. It's just how you see it, he continued to mumble. I'm sure I can help you, my friend, but are you sure this is wise? Does a mountain feel sad because of its size? Confused by these words, Rue let out a grunt and said with a pout, I know what I want. Nodding his head, the wizard turned the sky green. And just for one second, it rained lima beans. With a whirl and a poof and a puff and a wee, Rue's nose was shrunk to the size of a pea. Jumping for joy, he went on his way, not hearing the last words the wizard did say. A permanent nose this will be by sunset. If you don't reconsider, this is what you will get. At the bottom of the hill, who pranced all about, hoping that someone would notice his snout. Then whom should appear from out of the blue, flaunting a schnozzle as big as a shoe? A monster so lovely, Rue was awed by her grace and struck by the beauty of her well-balanced face. Pardon me, sir, I've been looking all night for the one they call Rue, but he's nowhere in sight. I hear that he's funny and sweet and so kind, and the best part of all is his nose is like mine. I thought you were he, but I see that's not true. You have such a small nose, you couldn't be Rue. Crushed by her words, Rue felt very sad, for he wished he had shown her the nose he once had. A nose just like hers that had fit him so well, the same one that changed with the lima bean spell. What have I done, he whispered in wonder. I think I committed a horrible blunder. My old nose was perfect, yes, perfectly fine. It was me who disliked it all of the time. And he uttered these words, the sky turned green. And what fell on his head? Well, of course, lima beans. Rue looked at his nose as it started to grow, back to its old size, and so the story goes. He heard in the clouds the wizard from afar, be true to yourself and love who you are. And after that day, Rue never did hide the fact that his nose was a very large size.